the channel. So today was probably the best day ever. I went to lunch with my friend Ava at San Ambrose or Sant'Ambrose, as we like to say it. <laughs> and we had my favorite go-to meal, which was burrata, followed by a little gluten-free egg salad sandwich action, the best in town. And after lunch, we walked on over to Bite Beauty Lip Lab, where we made our own lip kits. So, I think Kylie Jenner meet Soho. <laughs> we had the options to choose from everything. We Every color, shade you can imagine, we mixed them, we picked our own favorite colors, we got to choose from matte, um, sheer, lip gloss, everything, even down to the scent of the lipstick. It was incredible. Um, so the process is you walk in, and you start off with a wild cherry exfoliator, which is super nice because it's very cold here in New York and they blast the heat indoors, so my lips have been super chapped. So I exfoliated them and it felt like a baby's bottom. And once they're all exfoliated and soft, looking plump, uh, we followed by a lip mask, which was super hydrating and super glossy. And I kept the lip mask on as I made my lipstick. So my first uh, lipstick that I made was a nude that I named Skinny Dip. <laughs> and my nude, I wanted to basically match my natural lip color but amped up a little bit. So it's a little pinky, a little taupey, and I the finish I have on it is sheer so it doesn't look too lipsticky. And after that, I made another color, which I called Pinot Noir, please. And it's a very deep red wine uh, color with a little bit of brown mixed in. It took me two tries to get the color right on this one. The nude one I did was right off the bat perfect. And the second one, it took a little bit more mixing, a little bit more brown than I did red. And yeah, after that we put it into like this frozen icicle thing that you pour in and it cooks on this basically like this super cold ice cube for about 10 minutes. And after that she popped them out, put them in the lipstick palette and voila, waited 20 minutes and then I applied it and it was perfect. So it's super easy, it's super fun, and super creative thing to do on a day off. So this is what I got with the Bite Lip Lab. The first thing they give you is the exfoliator, the lip mask, and a lip liner primer. I'll show you guys. <laughs> that would happen. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the first step, the Fruit Scrub Whipped Berry Exfoliant. And I'm not going to do it, but I'll just show you guys. You put this on and you rub it in, you scrub, 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 and then you wipe it off and your lips will feel brand new. And then you take the Agave Lip Mask. It's super hydrating, lather it on, but before you put on the lipstick, make sure to wipe it off, especially with my red lip that I'm doing because the finish is matte, so I don't want it looking glossy. The next step is the, wow, oh, these letters are very small, Bite Beauty Line and Define Lip Primer. So you outline your lip, fill it in, prime it all up. So actually I'm going to do that step now because I already exfoliated and already have the mask on. Oh and this is a mirror so I can see what I'm doing. <laughs> and then the next thing they gave me are my lips. Not my lips, my lipsticks that I made. It comes in this cute little packaging. And I actually did two lipsticks, but the third one is a mix of Ava's, the two that she did. 
just kind of cool. I'll show you guys. This is the red, my Pinot Noir, please. That's the one I'm going to be putting on for you guys. This one is my nude that I made. And this one is the mix of Ava's two lipsticks that she made, which is cool. It's like kind of stripy. And I really love the packaging of the lipsticks. It's like a matte black with like little glossy lips on it. Super cute. So I'm going to put on Pinot Noir, please. And by the way, when you make a lip color there, they write down all the measurements of the amount of colors they use to mix it, and they put it on file. So if you guys want this, you can definitely go in to any Bite Lip Lab and get my color that I made. Here we go. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. I'm not very good at putting on makeup. I'm sure you, all of you real makeup artists out there are cringing at me doing this because I know I'm not doing it right. please <laughs> thanks for tuning in guys and like subscribe and show me what you guys think <laughs>